Hey everybody, how you doing? This is about to be a really fun video. I'm going out to the woods today. I've got to cover some ground really fast. I'm taking my electric bike and I figured it'd be a good time to show you guys how I use these electric bikes for hunting. It saves me a whole lot of time, helps me cover a whole lot of ground. And I don't have to do a whole lot but sit there and whoop, twist the throttle. But this is my electric electric that's electric electric without the e at the beginning it's my electric electric bicycle short story i've had this thing up to 21 miles an hour and i'm 275 pounds six foot six but really this was the most affordable one that i could find that was still beefy enough where a grown man like me could get on it twist that throttle and go 21 mile an hour but I've had it on road, I've had it off road. I'm just gonna show you this thing real quick and then we're gonna hit to the woods. I've gotta put some mineral out. I gotta go grab a trail camera and do some other stuff like that in the woods. And I'm trying to save some time today, but this thing came assembled already in the box. It has a hinge here in the middle. I literally just had to whoop, put it together, uh, make a few electrical connections and then I was ready to go. But let me just give you a real quick overview. Then we're gonna hit the woods neighbor uh thought this was a good time to weed eat always happens every time i'm outside i'm just going to give you guys a real quick look at this thing so it's got some pretty beefy tires on there what are the size i know it says twenty by three point oh there it's got some knobbies on it like i said i've had it off road quite a bit too no problem and let's just go, well, first of all, it's got this big old nice cushy seat, even for a big guy like me. It has all kinds of attachments. I got this on the back. You can also get saddlebags and all kind of stuff. Go check out their website. Give you a close up of the brand. That's the brand there. Electric, like I said, without the E at the beginning. It is a bicycle. It does have gears. You got your gear selector up here. Real easy to use shouldn't do this unless you're driving but hey you know what I'm saying and then we've got the display here I'll just give you a real quick look I got my cell phone holder on there power button over here and then plus and minus definitely want to read the manual on this one because it has a whole lot it can do I'm gonna hold the power button it's gonna come on there I got full power press the up button that's gonna tell me which mode I'm in to give me the most speed. I pretty much almost always run it up to five. And then this right here is the throttle. Whoop, whoop, whoop. This thing has a lot of power. I'm telling you guys, this is not a kid story. Like I said, I'm 275 and I've had this thing 21 mile an hour. So not a kid story. And then it's got really good working brakes, rear brake, front brake I think I have those right and like I said all that was already connected all I had to do was get it out of the box <clears throat> and unhinge this plug in a few of the electrical connections and then that was it but hey I'm gonna throw this up in the truck and we're gonna hit the woods I've got to go check some trail cameras and stuff I'll bring you along with me tailgate's kind of sketchy on this board Come on. Alright. Now I'm gonna strap some gear on the back there and then we're gonna be ready to ride. Alright, now y'all are gonna watch me right off into the sunset to my secret spot but the funny thing is i don't have a cameraman so i'm y'all gonna watch me ride out then i'm gonna ride back pick up the camera and then really go to where i'm going but check this out some zoom zoom footage Put it up to five power. kick stand up we ready
Boom. All right, so back and grabbing the camera, but every time I jump on that thing, it surprises me how much boogie it's got on it. But now I'm actually gonna go hit the woods. We're gonna do some off-road riding. Should be pretty cool. Here we go. Joker's pretty fast. No pedaling. Also, the part where we get a bunch of tips. All right, now we're gonna sneak in here a little more quiet, like still on the bike. So I was going pretty near full speed because like I said, I don't like people knowing where I'm at and where I'm going. But uh made it in the edge of the tree line here. In the wintertime, I could ride this bike. Oh, you see a tree fell right here, but in the wintertime, I could ride this bike straight to the spot where I'm headed. <laughs> it's a secret. But you can see there's some some of this uh, overgrowth now that it's summertime, I'm gonna creep on through here real slow like. But yeah, this bike makes everything so easy. We're hauling equipment and everything. I just covered like, shoot, I should have looked at the, I should have reset the trip odometer, but close to half a mile in like less than a minute for me trudging and walking and all that would have taken me. 10 times as long and I'd be wore out. But hey, I'm still in a good mood and I'm happy because my bike is zipping us through the woods, man. But hey, we'll get out here and check some trail cameras and head back to the truck. I love it. Being in the woods, it's better than just about anything else. So I got the bike over that log right there, but now I'm just slow creeping back through here. This fresh, growth this bike can just rip right through it so that's my uh my pack mule somebody might say oh man you're just being lazy man, i think it's more smart than lazy but hey here we go creeping through the woods here hmm that way we got a log this way no log let's go this way Man, what's up with all these trees falling down? All kind of trees fell right through here. Last year in deer season, this was a really big clearing right here. Hmm, interesting. But I spot the trail camera we're after right there. Where is it at? Yeah, right there. That's what we're after back here. Check that camera. Man. Look at this jumping trees and stuff with this thing. That's some live action right here. Come on, jump that baby. Yep. There we go. So, here's my camera. I did not even have to get off of this seat to get all the way back here in the woods. Now, granted, if you're in a spot that doesn't have somewhat of some clearings, it's going to be harder. But even that big tree that fell down right when I cut in the tree line, I just kind of 
lightly stood up, hit the gas, and we just bebopped right over it. But now, I'm gonna check this trail camera. I'll check back in with you guys on my way out. All right, I grabbed my trail camera. It's in my backpack that I was out here after. You can see a lot of this stuff, there's not a whole lot of undergrowth or we can cut through there. So this thing, this bike, saved me a whole lot of time now. We're fixing to come through. I stopped and turned the camera on because we got through a little bit of a thick part. Obviously, I can drive the bike through that stuff, but check this out. It's kind of thick. The field where we came in is over there where that sunlight patch is. Big log right there where we came in. I'm just going to try to show you guys how I got in here. So this is pretty thick, but we can just kind of muscle our way through here on the bike. Oh yeah, no problem. Gave her the veins there. And then when I get to this tree, I'm just gonna lift up on the handlebars a little bit and just kind of scoot right over it. Here's my log here. It's gonna be shaky. I don't have a cameraman. <laughs> get through the log here. Just gonna, woo, woo, woo. I'm popping wheelies through the woods, so. Just lifted my front tire over that log. We're just gonna give it the gas. Help it up. And then, so this one log was the only thing keeping me from just free riding through the woods here, but man, if you've never tried one of these electric bikes, man, check them out. Like I said, this one's electric. I think we can scoot out here to the edge of the field here and then I might put in some music so y'all don't have to hear wind noise and we're gonna ride this baby back to the truck check it out I'm gonna slow roll through here I probably hadn't showed you guys enough yet but this is the throttle right here see how it's making me go I got it on five power right there we're just gonna slow roll here to get us out to the field oh yeah Woo. all right now Woo whoa boy a little too fast now they actually cut this field for hay so it's pretty uh easy to ride through but i'm just gonna give it full power here and y'all can ride along with me and back out to the truck here we go. So this right here is zero pedaling. Just using the gas. Even in a, what I'd call a pretty thick field here, the hay or whatever this is, is about two foot high in most places. And on high power, I'm just ripping right along through it. Don't even have to pedal. How easy is that? Save me a lot of time and energy. I love it. This would have taken me at least half a day before and now I'm getting it all done. Right, half an hour, 45 minutes going way back in there. But here comes the road. We'll give it some pedal. Ugh. Get up in the ditch. Now, out here on the street, this baby will fly. Woo. Oh, that breeze feels good after sweating all this. Back to the truck. But hey, there you go guys. Super quick video showing you guys my electric bike. This thing is from electric, like I said. Super awesome super easy and these right here don't cost as much as a car like some of the other ones do but hey i'm six foot six getting close to 300 pounds and this thing will zip me at over 20 miles an hour and even navigate back there in the woods with the thick stuff ripping me through the vines and stuff that's why i wore these uh 
tough material pants so I could just ram right through the thorns on this bike. But hey, can haul all your gear and you save you a whole bunch of time. And if you're like me, help people from knowing where you're at. I parked my truck today, or with my backpack. Parked my truck today quite a ways away from where I was going in because I don't know, want people knowing my secret spot. But hey, check them out, Electric Bikes. Appreciate y'all. We'll see y'all on the next one. Hootie hoo! Stand up.